We're talking about systems, which is a taboo word in cinematography. Everybody thinks, uh, or they like to think of themselves as cinematographers, as artists, as people that, you know, fly by the seat of their pants and they just feel the images and the artistry comes to them or speaks to them project to project. And they don't have to have a system because that will limit them. Uh, when in fact, I see it as quite the opposite. I, see, I think a system, which is really just, what is it, a set of procedures or principles um, according to which something is done. And so if you're going to be in the same position over and over and over again, why does it pay to have a system? Because it eliminates variables, right? It eliminates uh, things that might come up that you might not have been expecting. If you have a system, you can tick off all of those things that might come up before they happen. So you might make a mistake on set. If you don't have, if you have a system, you might make a mistake. But if you have a system for checking on that to make sure it doesn't happen again, you're not going to make the same mistake twice. And the whole goal of this is to allocate energy as efficiently as possible, both in the pre-production phase and in production.